Miss Mar from Marisa, and today I'm going to show you how to make my favorite blueberry smoothie recipe. Hence why I'm wearing so much blue. I hope you enjoy. All right, so let's get started. Um, today's blueberry smoothie, we are going to need a couple fun ingredients. We're going to need some blueberries, of course. I like to use half of a banana, and today mine is frozen. Um, some ice and some yogurt. Now, one thing I like to add that isn't needed is some milk. Now, I'm gonna use some vanilla almond milk today. Um, and the only other ingredient, or not ingredient, the only other piece of equipment you are going to need is a blender. So you can use a regular blender. Today, I'm gonna use a little bullet cup um, with my bullet blender. Um, but yeah, let's get started. All right, so here is my bullet blender and my bullet cup. We're gonna start by throwing our half of a frozen banana in the blender. Then I have a half cup of fresh blueberries. You could use fresh or frozen. Now, blueberries and bananas are both delicious and healthy fruits that are very, very good for us. Our next ingredient is going to be some plain Greek yogurt. You could use a uh, vanilla yogurt, a blueberry yogurt, whatever kind you want. I like plain because I don't like it to be too, too sweet. Now this is just about one cup and I'm spilling all over. And yogurt comes from the dairy food group, okay? Now our last ingredient that you need is a couple of ice cubes. I don't have a ton of room, so I think I'm just gonna add like three. And I like my smoothies a little bit thinner. I don't like them super thick. So I am gonna add some almond milk. You could add regular milk if you like yours a little thinner or um, orange juice. A whole 100% juice would work as well. So now I'm gonna throw the lid on top of this. And we're gonna blend it up and see how it turns out. I need to shake my blender cup up again a little bit to get it to mix up. All right, I think we're there. And here is our delicious blueberry smoothie. Oh, that looks so good. I can't wait to try it. I hope you get to make this recipe at home. I hope it tastes as delicious as it looks. Um, awesome. Thanks for watching.